Okay, this is a quick video that explains how to get um, your video from an RX100 Mark V to uh, an iPad running iOS 10. It'll also work on iPhone um, running iOS 10 as well. Um, it definitely works on iPhone 7. I, I haven't tried this on an iPhone 6. I have suspicions that if you're bringing across 4K material that the iPhone 6 won't be able to play it. But it definitely works on an iPhone 7 and on an iPad 10.5 inch. Okay, so I have some video recorded on my RX100 Mark V. Um, if I view the video, quick test video. Okay, enough of that. Okay, so what we need to do is we need to go to menu. Bring up the menu. And the very first thing we need to do is go over to the tools option. And I think it's menu number four where we have USB connection. By default, it's set for auto. You want to change that to MTP. Now, one other thing we need to change is USB power supply. If you don't change that and you leave that to on, when you plug the camera into the iPad, it, um, the iPad thinks it needs to charge the camera. Therefore, uh, it can't, can't power it and it complains. So, turn this off. USB power supply, turn that off. And then what we need, we need two other things. We need, um, um, this is your micro USB for the camera. Let's plug this in without damaging the port. This is what I hate. I'm always worried about damaging the port. Okay. And then I have this. This is the lightning to USB uh, adapter. Now this is the USB 2 version. This is a slightly older version. They have a newer version out that's USB 3, which gives you faster transfer speeds. The big advantage of the other one also is that there's an ability to add it to external power. So you can actually um, power cameras and various other things from it. And I plug this in here, right way around, and plug this into the, let's just show this before I plug it in. So plug this into the camera or into the iPad. There we go. Now you can see it's there. And if I hit import all, it'll take a while. It is USB 2, so it's going to be a little bit slow. Okay, that's it done. We can see that it's imported it. So if I remove this,